So we saw you and your team doing a really, really good effort yesterday to try one last time to get this uh, KOM jersey going for the points. Uh, it was just a little, little, little bit too short in the end. Um, were you happy with what you threw at it and content with the try? Yeah, for sure. We, yesterday we was the hour, the last, the last chance. So we, we tried everything, and, but you know, I was out of the play, out of the game uh, for more than one week because I was sick. So. I didn't take point, nothing. Uh, I tried everything in three days. Uh, it was too hard, uh, but we was it was there. It was close, uh, but you know now the jersey is on the. I mean, Vingegaard is the best climber in the world now, and it's correct that he he won also the mountain jersey. Do you, do you think there is some space to consider how they award the points on the climbs in the Tour de France? This is the third year in a row that the yellow jersey winner is also going to have the mountains competition. And there's some people argue, well, the yellow jersey usually is the best climber. But yeah. as fans, it would be exciting to see someone else in the podium, someone else in the jersey. Yeah, I know, but uh, especially when you have the finish line on the on the on the climb, uh, it's also correct to to take a point. So I think uh, in the end, this rule is correct. Uh, maybe if someone else want want to win the state, want to win the, the this jersey, he need to attack more. He need to be more in the breakaway, and he need to take a point everywhere. Uh, otherwise, the GC rider they can win also the other jersey.